Well, I'm continuing to travel around Israel and meet and engage with all different communities in Israel. Today, I wanted to come to Kfar Julis uh, to spend time with the leadership of the Druze community in Israel. Uh, I was welcomed by Sheikh Muafak Tarif, uh, the leader, the spiritual leader of the Druze community, uh, at the home of and at the site of the tomb of his grandfather, uh, the great Druze leader Sheikh Amin Tarif. I uh, had a chance to spend time with uh, leaders of the Druze community, uh, judges, uh, local leaders, leaders in the national government as well, uh, and hear about their commitment to making Israel uh, a strong and democratic state. We had a, a wonderful, sumptuous lunch uh, and an opportunity for further discussion with some of the leading officers uh, of this community, people who have served at high ranks in the military and the police, uh, and then went to a wonderful museum uh, that uh, helps the Druze community hold on to their heritage. Uh, it's a community that uh, keeps its traditions, uh, that is very close, uh, close-knit, uh, and because of those traditions and that heritage, uh, they continue to be a very strong part of Israeli society. The Druze make a huge contribution to Israel. Uh, they serve in the military, uh, numbers far exceeding their uh, proportion of the population. Uh, they participate in business, they participate in government, uh, and as a minority uh, that depends on the strength of a democracy, uh, they have a lot in common with uh, Americans who really appreciate those democratic values about the state of Israel, where a minority like the Druze uh, can thrive and can contribute. יש איזה הבדלים בין המורשת של דרוזים פה בישראל ולדרוזים בסוריה ודרוזים בלבנון. אותה מורשת, אותם דברים כמעט, חוץ מדברים קטנים של עבודות יד, שאנחנו גם מזהים אותם, שזה כן. עבודה דרוזית. כן. Uh, and uh, it was a great honor to spend time with them today in their community.